Hey, welcome back everyone, Mun here. So we are back with Bear and Breakfast. We are now officially starting at High Lake. Um, go to the Dark Grove and find Sage for Julia. Repair the campsite near the farmhouse. Let's do this. So we got that done. Okay, let's see what we need here and let's get this done and then we can go to Black Grove. Tony's construction service. Welcome to the High Lake camp. Would you like to repair it? Yeah. Step one, it looks like the work site is good to go. Gather construction materials needed to repair the site. In this case, plywood, planks, stone bricks, and copper plates. I think I have enough of everything. Yep. It's because I think I'm such a treasure goblin. <laughs> Ooh. That looks so cool. Okay, and now, is there anything? Oh, no available instructions. Oh, so that's that. Beautiful. Okay, so this is only for here. Um, no, not yet. Oh, trash, trash, trash. Oh, there's more trash. You see how many, how much fruit and goodies is in this area? There's herbs. This is mint. Yes, I forgot that we got mint. More mint. But I think we can eventually start cooking in the diner, perhaps. Not sure. Oh, there's Phil. More apples. Sorry. Okay, we'll eventually get to where we need to. Am I full? Oh well, looks like I'm full. Okay, let's go put some... Really, am I full, full, full? What, can we only keep 40 apples? Guitar stand. I think I'm gonna put these out. Gosh, look at this. 31. I really don't know what to do with half of these things. We finally have some uh, iron nails. Okay, let me put... Toilet. Bus sign will keep on us. These, I see no use. Um, this. 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 Used to communicate across long distances. I'm... Um, Quest items, all right, so that's what we need there. Furniture, let's organize. And fill, all right. We now have some space, let's fast travel. Um, oh yes, we need to go to Sawdust, it's top left. I think where she's sending us. I remember it being there, don't ask me why. Hey, Tony! Oh, it is. Freaky. Hold on, wait. Okay, what am I? Herbs. She wanted sage. So herbs. Okay, what would sage look like? There it is. Sage. And then I'm gonna get some more. Oh, while I'm here, I might as well get us as much as possible. I'm wondering what is here. So here's another. We obviously need a prospector's gear, which we don't have yet. Hopefully, we'll get that in High Lakes. That'd be super cool. Oh. Shrooms don't mind. And then I'm also going to just do a drive by past the diner and then go put all this food in there 
What is this place? Okay, how do, would I get in here? Clearly this way? Hey! Gus, you again. I think we got off on the wrong foot. And now I used up both. I never meant to um, say nice things about you. Yeah, well, you can't just do that to people. You could ruin someone's day. But you said pleasant things about me too, I think. That's different. It wasn't about me. What are you doing here anyway? Are you following me around? No one comes to Dark Grove. I thought I'd start my day off right with a little self-terror. Beats washing your face with water. Finally, you make some sense. What are you up to? In case I've accidentally given you the impression that I'm a space scientist or something, I like to scavenge. It's what I do. I get into every nook and cranny and fish out all the artifacts the universe forgot about. Now, no one's stepped foot into Dark Grove in years. And this tower here is old. Like, really old. You can tell by the fact that there isn't a tower anymore. But that doesn't stop humans from using it anyway. At least until they up and left, tearing everything down behind them. So, like a nerd in a board game shop, I dive right in, getting my little trinket fix. No one can tell me not to. I wouldn't dream of it. Is that how you got your jacket? Oh yes, my little green jacket. I found it in a white house up the mountain. I'll ro I roll around in the garbage dump once a week to keep it fresh. Ugh. Well, I really like it. It's a nice jacket. Uh, yeah, this old thing, it's actually gotten pretty musty and I can get... I can't get the mud smell out of it. I should probably change it soon. You don't say. Hey, Pickens, been slim on the old grub department. You wouldn't happen to have anything to gnaw on, would you? I could go make you something. Boy, I'd kill for an egg dippy. In fact, I'm pretty sure I have... What is an egg dippy? What a strange wooden leg. What? What a strange wooden leg. All right. Feels like a skeleton should jump at me. At, what jump up at me any time? Okay, so how do I make an egg dippy? A little bready stick dipped inside a creamy egg would really hit the spot right now. I don't have eggs. Okay, well, who is here? That looked expensive. Bags of seeds. Yeah, that does look expensive, really. Well, I think I've explored everywhere. Let's go. Let's go give Julia her sage. And then try cook an egg dippy for, uh, for old Oh, concierge. <laughs> so cute. Okay. I am now no longer going to be picking up too many things, considering I'm a pack rat myself. Oh, no. Down here. Julia, Julia. I like. Yes, travel, please. Here we come. I can't wait to stop building and getting guests in here. All right. Oh, there she is. Hello, darling. Uh-oh. Hello again. I'll be honest, I wasn't expecting you back. Did you find any sage? Yes, Ratcha. What? You really got some? Oh my, it really is. So musty and crisp. Did you really go all the way there to Dark Rove? Piece of cake, so you bears don't have to worry about underwear. <laughs> Listen, if you're serious about getting this place back on its feet, I think I can help. The captain's family ate all sorts of food. They'd grow it in the garden and cook it down into flavors you've never even dreamt of. Sweet, sour, buttery, earthy, smoky, tangy. I didn't know I could taste words before. And well, I know for a fact your humans are going to want some, so I can teach you how to do that. If you'd like to stick around, I would love to. Great. I mean, I'm happy to hear that. You can help yourself from the garden. Things grow pretty fast in there. So help yourself. Aww. Thanks, Jules. 
she's so sweet. Now teach me your culinary arts. You can help yourself from the garden. Oh, of course, we read that. Now the captain had a big table and the family would sit around it. Ooh. Right. Visit the shop pawn voyage and you've unlocked a little dinner stool. You've unlocked a craft small ply wood table. You've unlocked a new craft at the tiny buffet recipe. Cool. All right, so dining rooms are rooms where your guests can consume food. Dining rooms are oh, cute, so little tables. Okay, table chair to make it functional and give a food score. Oh my gosh. Then meals added in the serving table will give out their food score to guests. Guests will consume these meals and usually... Oh. Interesting. Each dining room will affect the entire building, so resorts with multiple buildings will require multiple... Oh, with multiple buildings will require multiple... Oh, right. Dining rooms. And distillery rooms. Raw ingredients will not award food score. Only cooked meals will. Okie dokie. Lower serving uh, level serving tables have fewer slots. Okie dokie. Well, that's good to know. Build a functional... Well, let's do so. Oh, look at this garden. So we got corn. I think those are herbs. Those are potatoes, onions. Well, we'll figure it out. Let us build the dining room. Build a room. Let's start off with... Mm, food? Oh, there's a kitchen and a dining room. Let's try. No, I don't want to go there. Um, are we going to do the rooms on the lower floor? And perhaps the dining, distillery and kitchen above? Okay, so we are currently going to be building a kitchen. This can be three by three. So I want to go. Oh wow. Okay, so I don't want to make it too small, too big, but we can definitely edit it. Right, and then we will put the door there. I just want to. I don't like the walls. Hide the walls, please. Right, and Cutting boards. Oh. But why? <gasps> of course. No, I don't want to do this. Okay, then it's... Yeah, absolutely. So we actually want to go up on floor, take it down. Oh, so it's quite small. This is fun. I think it would work. It would still work. So let's do a kitchen. I think we'll do one, two, three, just to be safe. And then the little door there. Then we will go, yes, craft. What do we need in the kitchen? Tiny buffet table, oh, cute. Um, Oh, okay. Well, that's not... And then we need to build food. Dining room. So let's do... Hmm. See, because the distillery needs to be pretty big itself as well. Can we rotate? Oh, we can. 
Just one sec. My little cat just walked in and he's soaking. No tea chat. I'll be right back. Okay, so we've got that. What does it need? So it needs a serving table, dining, and chair. Alright, well, let's get that crafting on. So, tiny buffet. I think perhaps we'll do two for now. We can always build more. Then small. Let's see, that's bar still. I'm just making sure. So we'll do three of those. I think. Yeah, let's do five. And let's get our furniture on. Okay, wait. Yeah, I think we will do... Buffets next to each other. How cute. So, one. No, wait. Oh, this is not really gonna work, is it? Lower. Okay, so where's my chairs? Small plywood table. Did it not craft the, the little chairs? It's a bar stool. Little dinner stool. Ah, uh, because I didn't have space, right? So there's four. We'll do five, I guess, because that's all it's letting us do. And there we go. Let's put some chairs out. Oh no, that one won't work. Nor that one. All right. We need to make this room bigger. Yeah. What if we can't move it? No, no, no. Um, trying to think. Edit. Everything is tip top shape. School. Plus H. Room. Oh, that's cute. But. Wouldn't it be nice if we could just drag the whole thing? Mm, I have a feeling this is kind of a wasted space. But let's see what we can do. Actually, it needs to be a little bit higher. The stool needs to go. It's rotate you, put you there. Go there. Actually, perhaps just hello, sweetheart. I may have to make this bigger, like huge, and then perhaps put the distillery downstairs. Yes. No, 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 not delete, edit, edit, edit. So let's go there. Cannot build a room, but I'm not building it downstairs. <laughs> I suppose we'll just make this whole area. Yeah, that looks cool. I'd hate to know how much that just cost me. Alright, and let's go 
Now we can at least take the table out, do another one down here. Okay, let's do one, two, three, four, five. And then two. One, two, three, four, five. Looks like I can only make five. Oh, full again. All right, back to inventory. Maximize our efficiency. No, no, be straight, please. No, don't be cheeky. There we go. Five, one, two. Okay, back to crafting. <laughs> Sorry, this is taking so long. I, I think our inventory is just completely full. Um, let's do another five. And then... No, I think we'll leave it at five. Back to inventory. One. Oh, that's... Uh, uh. See, I can't put one here. It won't let me. That's okay. Then that will just be... I need two more. Come on, Mishpo. You could play nicely out in the rain, my boy. Alright. Crafting. Let's go back. It is... I think three, I said. Okay, let's do this. One... Two, three. Beautiful. Now I want to put more buffet tables. All right. And then crafting one more time. And then we need... I'm sure we can upgrade everything. That should be fine. But tiny, I think we'll do... Three more. And let's go back. So, one, two, and then we mustn't forget lights and all kind of jazz. Now, what do I need? Okay, food, kitchen. It says I need a door, which I've got, and cutting board. But I do have door. We don't have a cutting board, though. Oh, no, 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 no. Um, cancel, cancel, cancel. Yes, absolutely. What we'll do is, let's click on this bad boy. Edit. Yes, I think that'll do. Maybe there. Okay, great. That's just so weird. Perfection. And I think we're done. That's so cute. Um, what else is that that we need? I really need to stop doing that. Can't help it though. I just can't help it. What's wrong with you? What's going on? Um, All right. That's just pretty weird. Maybe there. I think it's cool. Okay, let's exit out. Oh, that was just a leaf. Perfect. Um, what is our mission? Cook one eggy dip for Gus. I need to go and tell Sabine. Gosh, that took a while. Sabine! Yeah, we need to start getting guests in as well as fast as possible. 
Uh -huh, cool. Oh. How about it? You got a campground ready to go? Yes, ma'am. Good going. I'm almost done. I'm just missing a bit of fuel and I left my canister behind. Can you fetch me some while I finish up? Uh, I do have some fuel for you. I've got tons. Got it right here. Alright, good. Now the key to the great camping spot is to make it feel the greatest waiting room in the world. It should be relaxing, quiet, but just temporary enough. So you don't overstay your welcome. I mean, you don't have to worry about that. Uh, visit the shop. So we've got... A small station recipe. Unlocked a new crafting recipe log. Small campfire. So wait. Just stop taking it. Okay, so the campfire is a type of special room that can only be built in certain areas outside. Oh, cute. Look at this. Okay, it's the perfect for more adventurous guests who prefer a moonlight wiener over an open fire. It requires a fire seating object and a dispenser to be functional and can be built in specifically designated outdoor areas. Some guests specifically look for campfires during their stay. Well, that's good to know. Build a campfire on the campsite. I still need to get this guy an egg. All right, let's go do this campfire. Where is it taking me? It's taking me to Julia, really. Why is it taking me to Julia? Oh, because we built the... Of course. Sorry, Julia, I just woke you up. That was about that dying room. It is ready! I can't believe you're going through all this trouble. I'm... Ahem, I'm sorry, I've been... by myself for a long time. There's barely a soul that passes through here these days. Except the ones who make a fuss at night, I guess. But I don't have the guts to confront them. That sounds terrifying. Anyway, you've got everything you need to start making some delicious food. Oh, except, like, the one important thing. Some way to cook it all. Now I did my best with what I had in the guest house, but I'm pretty proud of my little kitchen. Ooh, Ipswich Wholesale has new items available. Visit the shop. Uh, pawn, visit the shop. Gosh, you've unlocked the new... Crafting recipe, cast iron stove recipe. Ah, the puny cutting board, and that's what we need. Oh, sure, but she... Oh, you can... Oh, so she's got herbs. Now, cooking okay, items. See, so you still can't sell anything. Mm. All right. We need some guests up in this place. But first... Do we have space? <laughs> first of all. Oh, we got two slots, right. So, give me... One... Two... I'll be needing a few of these. Three... Four... Five... And then this one is 10 for 3. Who knows how all these seeds are. Oh my gosh. We really have a lot of stuff on us right now. I'm just actually going to put that in the buffet. Then this one is 14 for 2 only. Just more abstract painting. I'd rather get the bear because that's cheaper and you get the same amount. But I think let's start off with the lights for the time being. And that one's 10 for 2. It's a better option. It's also, that's 10 for 1. So this is actually the better rug. Okay, well we've got some lights. Farmhouse already level 2. Kitchens are rooms where you can cook meals. Okay, they require either a cutting board. Um, kitchen objects are noisy and smelly, which means they carry a negative. Oh, decoration score. No! Guests will not interact with kitchens. However, kitchens will apply a negative decoration score in the area. 
No. <laughs> uh, this debuff will affect any bedrooms next to the kitchens as well as the overall prestige score of the resort. You suck. Place plenty of decorations item to offset the negative effect of kitchens. Oh, you can see the debuff area clicking. All right. What a day. Oh, wrong thing. Okay. I oh, know, it's not moving. All right. That is craft. Craft any of you. I don't think it could craft any of that. Oh, did the cutting board. Beautiful. Okay, let us put a light. A light. And puny cutting board. Woohoo. <laughs> um, I think. Very cute. And then there we go. So we got all the five lights out. Oh yes, we wanted to craft a stone. Okay, let's pop off. There we go. Well let's hope it only affects us upstairs and not downstairs. Okay, well let's take our little guy. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, let's get the food out. Some tea. Oh, this isn't working well at all. Ah! <laughs> Alright, we need to take those chairs away. Live and learn, I guess. Okay. We need to go up one, please, and then we need to take you. Um, it can only be in here. Um, what do we do with this? Inventory. We're going to have to put it back. And take you, put you there. I have a funny feeling this is also going to be a bit of chaos. Maybe we'll just do... Three seater there. Maybe try. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We may. I did it again. Well, at least we can move here now. Okay, let's do food. So let's do popcorn. Oh dear, I need to go sort out all the other guests. That's what we got for now. I don't know any cooking recipes. Of course we don't. Oh gosh, now we need to build this as well. Holy moly! Crafting. Okay, well now we've got quite a bit of space. Beautiful. So we need... Let's do two of those. Do four of those. And perhaps two of those. Okay. Um, right. Small station. Why? What's wrong? That's not good. be placed in a hallway cannot be placed in a hallway I'm sorry but this is not a hallway mm, I'm 
am I losing my mind perhaps all right why is he running around with the game glitch <laughs> all right so furniture please give me oh no build a campfire on a campsite well we can't do that i'm afraid not in the hallway either all right let's go have a look here oh cool um i think i may have to restart crafting let's do a refrigerator and maybe we can start storing all our goodies yeah, no, this doesn't look right. <laughs> no, I'm supposed to be putting it in here. Sorry. Right. So let's... Furniture. Fridge, please. And then up one level. Right. Up one level first. Then we take the fridge. And I think... Leave it there. Oh my gosh, this is not looking good. Well, let's see what we can do. If it doesn't fix itself up, then we have a problem. Okay, so there's apples we can store. There's maize. Mushrooms, maybe we need more than one fridge. Because let's organize. So we need one, two, three, four, five, six. So we need another two fridges, actually, which is scaring the Cra no no craft kiddo. And give me two fridges, please. Done. It's gonna so negatively affect our score. I'm gonna have to over decorate like a crazy person. Simple. Did I just do it again? I did. Muppet. Uh, no, it's up one. There we go. Rotate. Oh, random. Um, maybe we can move the door down. That's unfortunate that I won't fit another. <laughs> I can already hear everyone going, don't put the stove by the fridge. <laughs> okay, I think we now have officially enough space to put all our stuff hey, hey, in there. Okay, that one's full. That one is not. Okay, so chamomile, herbs. Potatoes. Gosh, we actually do have a hang of a lot of stuff. Not much potatoes, though, however. Food. Uh, because I probably moved it around, right? I'm hoping so. Unless I click take all, like absolute muppet cooking so there's straws and now we'll keep the fuel in us all right um wait can i okay i can access everything in there perfect where do we get recipes from Okay, well, let's get this place up and running, first of all. Um, so let's do special. Oh. 
Right. So this is... Minimum size. Is this supposed to be many little campsites? Well, let's try. Selection outsides. Oh. Let's add. I'm going to add oh that's so cool all right now we can perhaps get rid of oh no never mind no let's save it okay so let's do one here one here one there All right, so we can only only have one. Oh, that kind of sucks. Everyone's just going to have to share a campfire, I guess. Mm, I think I'm going to store those. And there we go. All right. Super cool. Now, how on earth do we cook an egg dipped with fogas? Build a functional kitchen. Let's go visit Julia. Please teach us recipes, Jules. Oh. And where is Jules? Oh, she's this way. Did you manage to get the kitchen up and running? Yep. So, well, what are you waiting for? Time to give it its maiden voyage. I haven't exactly won any cooking competitions out there. Oh, nonsense, you're a natural. I can smell it on you. The smell is definitely all natural. Look, here's some basics to get you started. I'm sure not everyone's going to be picky from the get-go. Grab some tatters from the garden and some mint next to the lake and give your new kitchen a spin. What? Interact with any cooking place and bring the object to cooking screen. Any object in the kitchen will bring up... All right, cooking. You have to learn at least one recipe before you're able. But have I now? Okay. Put down a card in the cooking slot. Place an ingredient from your inventory in the cooking slot. Cooking. Place fill in there. Okay. Occupied fill slot from your inventory. And then press the cook button and wait for your food to be ready. Remember, the more objects you place, the more cards you gain to access. Right. No, I'm trusting you, Gulia. Well, let's go grab some more mint. Even though we probably have everything in there's the mint. Okay, well, let's go. Cook one mashed potatoes and mint tea. She has loads of faith. Okay, so feel. Oh. Maybe not all of it, but okay. Then roast, boil. So we're going to be boiling this. And potatoes. And we're going to be boiling pea. That's so cool. Well, let's mash potato to minty. Alright. Cook. Um... Can we only do one at a time, perhaps? Back, and then... 
Okay, mashed potatoes, back. Okay, so it's only one at a time, really. Oh, so it's locked. All right. Oh, cool. So there's our smashed potatoes. Okay, so there is fill again. We're going to be boiling mint. Yes, mint tea. Cook. Oh, this is okay. So it's not as difficult as I thought it would be. Thank you, thank you. Oh well. Here we go. Who knew? This one's taking actually forever. Uh, taters. And I think we used all the minty. Sort, please. Now, must we take them to it or can I put it in the buffet? Food, please. Then. Oh, we have to have them on us. Take all. Oh. Oh, Julia! I'm coming. I need a build. I think I might have messed up that campsite and I didn't build two. Did you get some cooking done? I sure did. Well, you certainly did something, but it's better than my first try. Visit the shop to find... Oh, beautiful! You better serve it before it gets cold. And there's her shop. It's now available to us. So, roasted potatoes. It's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. So we need 200. Wow, we also broke. Um... I'm just learning everything. So this is... I learned to boiled egg. I think we've got everything we need. But where do we get eggs from? I don't know. Okay. I need to do a quick teleport. Go get Gerson. We are broke. We are beyond broke people. Okay, let's timber crossing. Let's dash it. Alright. Oh, no guess. We are so bad. Alright, details. Let's do it. Guest requests. Except which one's got a level 14? None of them. Okay, so no. Back. Uh, 12, 11, 23, 23. You know what? Except. Actually, no. This is our money maker for the time being. We need to craft. Where's the good beds? There we go. So I need one, two, three, four, five. Beautiful. Then we're taking you. Oh, stunning. Oh, this is going to cause a bit of a pickle, isn't it? Okay, 
You. No, you. It's actually looking pretty cute. is too big for the room. What is that? gonna live there now all right here we go what do we do with all these bits who do like we sell them to i don't know we'll figure it out okay let us now hope that's gonna push up the comfort level we need mula okay so that's 13 14 all right guess so you my dear sure but we don't we're not gonna meet that simple Guest request, that's 23. We'll give you that one. 11, 14. Uh, we'll give you that one. You guys are just out of this world. Okay, we're going to start getting bad reviews, I reckon. Well, we got guests coming in, so... Let's travel to the A24. No, come click on you. Let's go. Let's go. I wonder where we can get eggs from. Oh my gosh. No one's here. Okay. It's guest requests. No guest requests. Special rooms, guest traits, 88, perfect school. Now, are these beds big enough to accommodate? I think they are. Okay, let's build more comfy beds. We only need three. I'm not gonna build this place up much more than I have to. Okay, we're just gonna take you. Okay, little bed. Hey, don't be cheeky. You? Okay. Done. There we go. Crafting, clothing furniture so we got eight little bits we need rubbish little bits <laughs> um i think let's sleep there is nothing really for us to do here okay welcome this was for increasing pattern bragging rights what is this one build five level two bedrooms a cool trinket that will help tell time No, I don't really want to do this, to be honest. But what recipes do you have for us? Oh, we've got those, weirdly enough. I don't know why they still have them there. Um, let me put... Oh, cool. I've got quite a lot of... Oh, so this is actually... doesn't matter where you put them in. It's available everywhere. That's actually pretty awesome. Well, let's sleep so we can get some guests in. Um, yeah, let's do that. Right. We need some money fast, so he's only 12 comfort, 2 hygiene. Yeah, let's assign you that one. Another one there. Sign. No, not you. He's also one there. Okay, beautiful. 
So we're going to start getting money in. That's great. I know I should build another bedroom. But it would have to be a weird one over here. Mm. I'm not 100% sure that... It... I wonder if we can build the kitchen here, though. Build special... No, this is only for distillery only. Okie dokie. That other, the Hylex one has really taken us a while to set up and, and sort out. It, it's been a bit of a tough one. Alright, rubbish, gimme. I wonder if this lady would be so kind to sell us some eggs or guy. Oh, <gasps> you beauty. Oh, we don't have much money. Okay, well, let's get some, an egg, one egg. But I didn't, oh, I need two of those. There's rice, cheese, maple syrup, butter. Actually, I'll be needing bread. Eek. Why can't we sell anything? <laughs> All right. I think we probably need butter as well. Okay, well, let's leave. Oh, I need to place it in the serving station. Yes, ma'am. No, this doesn't belong to me. Oh, that's a double door fridge. Sweet. Okay, let's fast travel back to High Lakes and get some stuff seen too. So we've got people coming in, which is great. It's so funny, like if you don't keep an eye on it, it's madness. Okay, let's do this, do this, do this. Oh, wait. Let's go... What, can't we... Marshmallows? No. So we can't really do anything for these. Okay. Random. I thought we would have needed the marshmallows. Okay, let's see. We can... Boiled egg. He didn't ask for a boiled egg, did he? Cook eggy dippy for Gus. How do you make an eggy dippy? Ah, there you are, you beauty. Okay, so we need... So we need to boil one egg and get some fill there. Hmm feel and then we need to roast a bread cook oh sweet okay cool do we really need to build bit uh, bedrooms and find more nails hey gus guess what my man oh yeah while we're here let's put no 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 bud no no that was like unnecessary for you to jump down the stairs like an absolute hero Okay, and you can go there. Gulia, I did what you wanted. Okay, let's just go chat to old Jules there. She's probably putting around. Oh, come on, woman. Stick to your guns. Oh. Wait. Did you serve the food? Yep. Well, congratulations, Hank. You've cooked your first batch of food for someone else, and that's nothing to sneeze at. Now you better make sure there's always food in there for folks to eat. You can make the same stuff, sure, but you'll run out of ingredients quick. So you better learn how to cook more stuff than mash and tea. I've got plenty of recipes from the Cactuans cookbook. Come by my little booth sometime. I could always use the coin. Darling, I am broke because I used all my coin. <laughs> you lucky sausage. 
I just want to make sure that there isn't. No, we, we have got it all. Beautiful. Now, Eggy Dippy for Monkey Man. He is in Dark Grove, so now we have to fast travel. Is there anything else I can plop in here? That's part of the quest. All right. Come up later, I guess. We need to pop up to Sawdust. Let's go get that one done. And then we can finally come back and then maybe build a couple of rooms. And finally earn some money. Let's stash it. Run, rabbit, run. Okay, how much plywood and... No, we still got loads. Oh, cool. That can finally fit there now. Oh, that would be good if I'd actually had a look. So why doesn't it organize it properly like that, then? Let's just double check that I don't have any more doubles. That was a silly thing for it to have done. That's a bit of a silly thing. I think they, when you click organize, it should automatically grab all of that. Or arrange it or sort it out in a way that it won't... That wasn't very pleasant. I'm sure I saw eyes in the corner. Like those spooky eyes we saw in the beginning. There you go, bud. Hey, Gus. You got something for me back there? Fresh out the kitchen. Salty, savory, creamy, delicious. Tastes like I'm about to do something useful. You make a mean egg dippy, big boy. Thanks, I didn't lay it. I only cooked it. Oh, gross. Pig. We used to get Eggy Dippy once a year, if that. My poor ma, I don't blame her. She did the best she could. We were 12 brothers and she had to carry us all on her back. <laughs> Literally. And we were all little dumbasses too, driving her up the wall. Oh man, I don't think if my mom could have handled more than one hank. I remember one time, my two older brothers and I got up in the middle of the night to steal the pudding. And we accidentally dropped the whole bowl from the third floor. I swear her mouth was spouting fire. I thought I was for sure dying that night. I wasn't allowed out of the hole for three days straight. That wasn't the longest I got put in the hole. <laughs> did she ever put you somewhere nice when you did something good? Like a shelf up high somewhere? What? No, that's dumb. Besides, I don't remember doing something good, like ever. It was like we were 12 devils put on this earth to torment her. And boy, were we good at it. I don't know. I remember doing a lot of dumb things, but I don't think we ever had a hole. Well, you, did you get punished, forced to eat dish soap or all stick over the pool? I hated that one. She usually sat down with me and told me what I did wrong. Usually felt bad enough to apologize and never do it again. Oh, I see. That's dumb. <laughs> hey, you know what? When you're done scavenging, I think I could use some help with the humans. Oh, yeah. I'm not a big people bear and I was thinking I needed someone with some heart, some zing. And don't get me wrong, you do have a lot of stinky energy. Damn right. But maybe that's exactly what I need from someone running my concierge stand. Do you? You mean that? Of course. I could use someone scaring some moustaches off a few folks for a fair price. Well, that's one of the least dumb things you've said today, Hank. Listen, if you come and help me, I, uh, I'll need my own little table with my own chair. Always the undeniable people possum, Gus had offered his services as a concierge. All he asked was for a little stand, though which he could take care of business, of course. Perfect position for such a charming individual. Deal. Okay, that's great. So great, I'm excited. This is awesome. You're awesome. Okay, Pawn Voyage. Visit the shop to find a new purchase available. Oh my gosh, you've been... <laughs> Guess concierge stand crafted at the workbench. Alrighty, duty. You got it. So there's nothing I can really do here. Alright. You've learned the blueprint for Gus's stand, now crafted at any workbench. Place Gus's stand anywhere in a resort to unlock your services for that area. You can turn on services throughout the cabin management screen. Gus will automatically accept new gears to any bedroom you indicate saving. You need to do it manually. All right. 
However, Gus won't be as good as you at matching bedrooms to guest needs. So choose which rooms you ask him to manage carefully. Every bedroom Gus manages will cost a fixed number of coins per day. If you run out of coins, his service will stop automatically and you will need to turn it on yourself. Likewise, if you edit the staff item... Oh, okay. All the rooms, it affects the service and the stop it needs to be turned on manually. Oh, alright. So... I'm trying to hear the background noises and it sounds incredibly eerie. I don't know if you can hear it. Gosh, another long one. It's raining. Come on. I think we'll set him up at this one. I think after we've, yeah, we've built him up there. All right. Nope, no rubbish. Um, oh, no, no, we don't have it yet. We need to buy it. But they don't... I don't get it. Or do we have it? Oh, we do. All right. Now, inventory, please. Where are we going to put him? Perhaps over here? Two hundred per day. I don't even have that. You madman! <laughs> Absolutely nuts. All right. Okay, guys. I'm gonna call it there for today. I really hope you enjoyed it. I'm. Um, Yep, well, we'll be definitely will be, I think, finishing up High Lakes uh, the next time and getting that sorted and done. It was just so much to get done before we could eventually get there. At least we bought the campsite, which was pretty awesome. And um, thank you so much for the new subscriptions, guys. You guys have been super incredible. And thanks so much for all the comments. It's been helping me so, so much. Please, guys, take it easy wherever you are. Peace and love. Mon out. <laughs>